What's up, y'all? Today, we're watching a video called We're Nudists, Ask Us Anything. Rob look a little different. Rob's looking a little different right about oh, now. I got boobs. Sorry. What if Rob turned into a girl and this is what he turned into? Do you think it'd be better for the channel? Yeah. Well, I'm... Parodies. But it's still Rob inside, like... Like, it's his personality, but it's your voice. It's Rob inside, yeah. Hey guys. He'd have to move out. Yeah, Why? What care. would happen? Because like Rob normally be out shirt off and shit. I could have my shirt off. I and, could have my shirt off right now. And you could, but me and Rob's relationship would change. And I Our couldn't. Our relationship, because I'm Rob. We're here with Kazumi, and you were in this Jubilee video. I have not seen this. I know nothing about this. Let's get straight to it. Would it be okay if I immerse myself with you guys and also got naked? That's the whole point, that's why we're here. <laughs> okay. Everyone oh should get naked. Okay. Do I just start asking questions? <laughs> okay. Okay. We're starting off like that. Well, I just want to first know, do you do you guys know each other already? Yes, uh, we're friends. We met through stand-up comedy, right? They had naked stand-up comedy. Mm. So if everyone's already naked, you don't have to imagine. I didn't know they had nude uh, comedy tours. That's interesting. He's Hell yeah. <laughs> naked audience, naked comedians, absolutely. Why do you think they blurt out the guy's nipples? I didn't even register that. Is it because he just has bigger... That, I think maybe that. boobs are just not allowed. Well, if he was ripped, I don't know if they're blurring it. You don't think, like, Chad Johnson, like, his nipples? are blurred out. <laughs> My, the point I was gonna make is, if I was a nudist, I feel like I would be ripped. I feel like you just wouldn't care about anything because it's like for yourself, <laughs> so you would just be like, naked. But you, I feel like that because I have the ability to put on clothes, it makes me like, well, I can eat Domino's and bullshit. Whereas if I was forced to, hey, every girl that you interact with is gonna see you butt ass naked, I swear to God, I get ripped. Yeah, you'd wanna like have an appealing looking body because mm -hmm. if that's what you're all about, but I get it, like they just wanna embrace what they have. The definition of a nudist is just someone who enjoys being nude. You don't have to go into a nudist community. You could just be naked at your house. But there is a nudist community, I would say because of everything else that there's a community for, you know? Mm. So this is just a place where you get to be with other like-minded individuals and also be comfortable in a safe space naked. When did you start your nudist journey? It was my partner uh, that looked into it and says, you know, we, we're nudists. And so that's when we started checking out uh, nude. Did you guys date a nudist? <laughs> It's gonna be a no for me. What if she's so hot? What if she has like a Megan Fox body? We can practice the nudist thing at the crib. I think I have an opinion that a lot of guys probably have the same thought of like, if it's your girl, you would prefer you be the only one to see her in a certain light. Like I can't go to Thanksgiving dinner and then it's Oh, like... I, I don't wanna eat naked. I feel like I wanna separate oh. my nakedness when I'm like eating and like, you know, eating my KFC and shit. As someone who is sometimes nude, like- I'm a part-time nudist. Yeah. Part-time nudist. Yeah. Are you more comfortable naked? But if it was like cozy, then yeah, I guess I would be naked. Or at least I'd keep the panties on, well, and just, just in case. Sometimes I sneeze and then I'm like, I squirt it. <sighs> Don't you hate when that happens? <laughs> yeah. Oh man. Me, I, I leave a snail trail. How do you keep oh, things like, off. sanitary? <laughs> oh dear. You know, <laughs> we, we're we human, uh, things happen, but that is the purpose of a towel. Tim is shook. It's I'm a moist girl. Oh, Standard etiquette. There you go. <laughs> Standard the the towel etiquette. You said snail trail. Are you is being that, serious? Is that just discharge? Yeah, I don't know. I just that because that don't sound. Are your pH balance is good. No, yeah, my pH <laughs> balance is great. Well, like... I heard girls don't wear underwear to the gym. No, because uh, that that'll, is... the discharge will happen when you work out. What? No, I think that's so you'd want like their bare wear pussy it? and leggings, like where like their bare pussy is like soaking the leggings. That's what into... it is. But yeah, but is it true that most girls don't wear underwear at the gym? I wear underwear to gym. I don't know. I don't go around. I read one tweet and then I generalized everybody. My bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't like ask girls like, hey, are you like wearing panties right now? <laughs> yeah. I never heard of girls now. I feel like they would simply too. I especially wear panties at the gym. I okay. feel like, like that's like moist time. False news. Yeah. False news. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It just happens no matter what. Is that every girl? Or like just... vaginal discharge? Yeah. And I feel yeah. like it's like boners. Like you're not always horny, but sometimes it just happens. I wouldn't want to just like be sitting, mm. like watching like my friend's recital naked and then I like leak everywhere. Like, oops. Also, I get like Russian roulette periods. Like mm. some days I'll be like, I'm safe. And then some days my vagina will be like, I'm fat. Mm. I'll just completely destroy my clothes. Wow. So I think I need a towel. Damn. I'm learning more. Secret meetup spots for other nudists or is it mostly like 
designated beaches. There are no secret meetups. There are public <laughs> organizations. Tim. Blurred tits, man. Why would you ask it? I, I really don't like when people act like, what kind of question is that? Brother, you're a nudist. I don't know anything. I, most people know nothing about that. That was not a bad or crazy question. Yo, I asked them. I'm going to go to a little nudist party. So they have oh, their own party. They have their own parties. They have their own organization that they gave to me and they have like their own little like events where they pop and see, up. See, I think that's what the guy was trying to figure out. Yeah, I don't think he like, meant like nudist Illuminati. I think he was just like, where can I come yeah, uh, right. see naked people? Tim, lighten up. People come over. Is it shoes off, bra off? Or like, <laughs> is it up to everyone's discretion when they start taking their clothes off? If you come to my house, I'm not gonna open the door naked. I, I'm sure some people do that. I don't. I do um, that. Oh. <laughs> I'm not a nudist. Why are you on that side? <laughs> they edit out all my fun, silly questions. I had like some raw. What was questions. like another question that they cut out? I think my thing was like, is it always sexual? Are we like desexualizing the whole body? Because mm. I know for a lot of like nudist communities, they're kind of not cool if you just fucking. Because they're like, yo, you're going to make everyone uncomfortable. The problem is, if you're an idealist, then ideally, the nude human body isn't inherently sexual. However, being a realist, if there is a really wonderfully shaped woman, and let's say I'm a guy and I'm looking at her, I'm not thinking, wow, that's just the human body. <laughs> no, I'm monkey brain goes, uh, uh, <laughs> there you go. So if your brain can do that, great. I, I think like Most people's can't. Context yeah. too. Like, I feel like if I saw like Rob came in here and his dick was out, I don't think I would be like, oh, I'm horny. Fuck. Mm -hmm. I think I would just be like, why is your dick out, bro? But it's like, you can't take a girl back to your crib after a date. And then as soon as you put your keys up on the door, you take your old clothes off. You're right. Yeah. I guess I yeah. would be like, wait, 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 wait. What exactly? Can we talk about it? Like, wait, what we, I'm not first? here to do that. No, no. I'm a nudist. There's a time and place for it all, I guess. So nudist mm -hmm. refer to people who wear clothes as textiles. Uh, the textiles think it's an overly sexual experience, but it's mm -hmm. so not. There's families and kids and elderly folks, and it's not Whoa. a, a strip club. If you happen to get an erection, these things Wait, kids happen. Are naked? Huh. And you are just, you don't flaunt it. You put a towel over it, you get in the pool, you don't make a big deal out of it, and it, it goes right. down. In America, it's very uh, fat white men, I would say. And, oh. and uh, as a fat white man yeah. sitting here, I'm <laughs> telling you, we want to embrace all the different types of folks and we would love gotta be a reason for that. to come and get involved and experience it. And so we're hoping to, you know, one person at a time. I'm in my head thinking, why is it? More it's predominantly fat, white, fat men. white men because- There's gotta be a correlation the, there. The girls- I feel like fat white guys love to be naked and chilling though. Why not black? I don't because you know how there's like these tropes of like, okay, like white people are very, I think, brave and daring for random things. So like, if you see someone climbing a rock wall, it's probably a white guy. If you see like a dude playing with wild animals and shit, it's probably a white guy. So I think there's something culturally about white American culture, if you want to call it that, is more fuck it. To his other point about nudist gatherings, it's kids there. All right, you lost. <laughs> that, no, I couldn't get past that. He said it so casually. If so I every... was a nudist, I don't think I would have my children there, but I would have a good conversation about how their naked body isn't always a bad or like At what age thing. though? 18! Like, they need to be was, thinking about that at six? Like it's okay when to When I was be a naked? kid, you know, like my parents would change in front of me and I wouldn't be like, oh my god, boobs and dick. You know, I would just be like, those are my parents changing. But it wasn't like they were partying naked. I don't know, kids means 11 and under. I mean, that's no. What's the biggest riff in the community? May I? <laughs> it would be imposters. It would be fake nudists. It would be resorts that claim I'm to be famous. we are non-sexual family friendly and then Tuesday is swinger night. And so us in the industry, that makes us look awful and bad and like it really sucks for any organization to find some people who don't live up to the ideals that we all preach. If I ask the question, are children allowed? And the answer is no. It probably is not a nudist resort. It's something more because nudism should include children. <sighs> I don't think it's necessarily a sexual thing. But, 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 if, <laughs> but, 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 but. <laughs> If they go to an event with other strangers, the kids should be exposed to other adults and other children that are strangers to them naked. I think when you're at, in a nudist community, I feel like there's just a general understanding that you don't think like the normal pervert, you know, and you like desexualize the human body like that. Yeah, but that's that just mean? it. That's the idealist, which is, well, the community is, you know, they're all cool with it. And that might be true, except for all it takes is one bad apple freaky yeah. person. Let's put a random nudist 
old guy. He's there, naked, being nude, but he's just looking at the girls. That's 11. He's looking at the kids. He's getting his kick out of it, but he's just a part of the nudist community. What's the benefit of bringing your child naked to an event with naked adults and other kids? I'm sorry, I'm gonna go ahead and Even blow the whistle. No, yeah. foul on the play, flag, You're like 15 yards back. No, I can't like, rock with Kids should be allowed! Hey, who said that? Who's <laughs> suggesting kids be here? You, FBI, open up. Do you guys think it's appropriate for children to be naked in front of adults? Yes. Yes. <laughs> uh, yes, this is uh, non-sexual, and we mean that non-sexual mm -hmm. lifestyle. Right. And it's affirming. It, it's, it's good for self-esteem and yes, for saying, yeah. you're fine the way you are, and this is what bodies look like. What does that do to a little girl that has to see a whole bunch of dicks around her? Even to me, looking at another dick is like, hey, I don't want to see that. Like, you guys you're have never your... seen each other's dicks before? On some homie? I, let me tell you. I feel like I see all my homies' genitals. <laughs> no male has seen my rhino horn. Your rhino horn? I'm just gonna give it that name. <laughs> um, <laughs> Aside from what you're saying, I think like an adults only nudist space is totally fine. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you wanna be naked with each other, fuck it. Do whatever you want. It's your, it's your human right. I don't think kids can decide. No. If Thank they you. Want no. to be there, yeah, no. Exactly. Thank you. Exactly. Well, my problem. mommy just brings me here. Yeah. What the fuck? Because That's the I problem. feel like if I was a kid, I would just do what my mom does. Correct. So exactly. I think because you trust her. You I, trust yeah, I your wouldn't parent. want. I like. I wouldn't want her to make the decision that now I'm around naked adults. Because even Correct. now, I could Correct. ask you like, "Hey, you want to be with a bunch of nudists?" You would have to deeply consider that because mm -hmm. that's depending on what you're comfortable with and what being naked means to you. Do you guys have kids? And if so, would you want your kids to follow your same footsteps? I don't have kids and I don't plan on having children. Well, that's uh, why you want kids to be I there. I think it is a healthy lifestyle. I do have a nephew and he knows about our lifestyle. I don't hang around with him naked. He is underage and he's not my child. When he turns 18 and he asks me, I want to try nudism, then I will uh, guide him. Yeah, I also don't have any kids what? of my own, but I'm Uncle Tim to a <laughs> bazillion kids. Mm -hmm. And more than just the kids, I've watched. I don't think he means that in like a sexual pervert way. Oh, I think it just fuck. means he's a fodder figure to Uncle children. Uncle Tim. <laughs> <laughs> we reacted to his nudes last time. He spazzed on us. Wait, so. he, where was he on before? Oh, did he comment on the video? Oh. Yeah, he like he 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 already didn't like us. From is this our first your, one. Is he this gonna your, see this again? Is this your arch nemesis? No, no look, I don't give a fuck about this guy. We I don't just, even know. We just said we don't understand it, and yeah. he got mad at us. I don't think he is a pervert. But is he about to say he's been naked around him? That's what I was waiting for. Well, no, that's exactly no. what he's saying. He's Uncle Tim to a bunch of. I don't think that kids. means Uncle Tim to like a bunch of naked kids. I think it just means he's like a father figure too. Okay, maybe it's his family. Yeah, like I think that's he's, what he just, means. he's just okay. a figure. Let me let him finish before before you like explode. I've seen the general generations of I knew this kid nudist now they're grown with kid nudists of their own and so oh, I've God. seen the positive effects of good body image <laughs> She's like, and, ah. uh, education not not worrying about naughty parts dirty parts but knowing oh that's what that looks like it's not a big deal I definitely agree with that yeah I feel like especially like in today's society it's like oh well you should cover up you like your nipples are showing yeah I mean that's a basic human right top yeah. freedom I can be topless and you can't. <gasps> we yeah. saw his nipples. Hey! Oh, that's weird. Exactly. Oh, oh. <laughs> I think it's funny they unblurred it for one second. So it's like, do you did you have to blur it that's at all? Like, what was the point? I cannot get sold on the on the kids thing. And look, to your point, this guy's not a criminal. Yeah. He's not a, one of those people. However, there are people that will take advantage of the system. Here's my thing. Can we, with all things, just let the kids be kids. Uh, yeah, keep the kids out. And of leave it. them keep, out of the out of it. The taboo, the all that stuff. And then when they're 18, let them decide. decide. Let them decide. Yay! I want to, but do I really want to? Oh, <laughs> yeah, okay. I couldn't. I couldn't. <laughs> it goes both ways, baby. We don't want you to see us. Maybe we don't want you. Where would yeah. we see home. you? Yeah, how about that? I'm about to say my favorite line, different strokes for different folks. I'm gonna go and watch Netflix on my bed butt naked. Just for an honor of But but that you never done that? That's like your right in prerogative. I don't your, think I'm in your room. You I know? like when I got a little something holding holding me in there. I mean, obviously we're all comfortable with our own bodies naked, but like, I, it's something about just having something. My pajamas is like one big T-shirt, panties. I'll be naked if it's like a special occasion. Mm. Like there's a dude in there. Like I can't sleep naked. You, like what if like there's like a woman? Okay, well I might naked? pass out after and then 
<laughs> 3 a.m. Where's my underwear? <laughs> yeah. It's weird though. Like I just said, you just want to put your underwear on real quick. That's really? You know, what I mean? you know how it goes afterwards? For guys, I, I, I can see clothes. girls. Yeah, like yeah, I like put to chill up. out, kind of cuddle, cuddle, cuddle. You can cuddle, but then I put something up. You're like, please put <laughs> <your> <laughs> <eyes> on. <laughs> we'll have Kazumi on another video. There see we go. Peace.